Hi, this is Shane Grantham, Grantham Consulting. I do computer service support and repair seven days a week. I'm putting back together a laptop that I just repaired a cooling problem, and this is the cover I'm putting back on. And my camera is moving on. So I'm just going to snap everything into place here. Make sure that everything is lined up. Where did those come from? Oh, those are for the hard drive. You want to see it. Here's the motherboard and everything. I had to take all the screws out of the back or the bottom of it to get the bottom cover off to access the, the heat sink and the fan. There. It's getting closer. I think it's back in. Yeah, I think I've got it back. That worked pretty well. Now I'm going to put all the screws back. I've got them all taped here. Nearest the hole that they go in. And this is the hard drive. I'm going to put that back in. Get this even closer. There. So, get the hard drive in there. in there. Now I have the screws. Now the hard drive is in here, it's right here, and I have to put the cover on it, which is right here. There's screws and the cover slides in there. <coughs> and the other two screws that are left over also secure the cover the bottom and then also go through the 
mounting holes for the hard drive. And the RAM, the two sticks of RAM are here. And I might as well put those or the cover for it on. It's right here. put all the screws back in the holes. And what I should do next is put the battery in and make sure the thing starts. That's always the fear I have is when working on the laptop is when you put it back together make sure it all works. So I guess I'll do that first. There's a couple ways you can take a laptop apart. Um, you can either, or to, I mean to secure the mounting hardware, you can put it, tape it to the holes, or you can draw a diagram next to it, and then draw uh, a depiction of the laptop cover and then put the screw over the hole where it goes. I've done it both ways, but I kind of like the tape method the best, as long as you don't lose the screws anywhere. Okay, so let's put the battery back in. It went right here. I gotta be careful these screws don't fall off. I wanna flip it around and hopefully it will turn on. The power button's right there. Okay, there's a good sign there, the video. Starting window, so that's good. As you can see it's starting up, so that's good. And I can hear the fan turning. That the client was uh, complaining of the laptop overheating, and the fan would just really start turning loud. And I cleaned out the uh, took the computer apart and. Blew out. I found some debris on the uh, vent intake on the inside, so it looks like it's coming back up now. So good. I just want to make sure it turned on. Now I'm going to shut it down when it gets up to Windows, and we'll finish putting the screws back on. This has been Shane Grantham, Grantham Consulting. Thanks.